All right, one year later, coach mentioned this morning, leaders got to step up. One of the guys that made it to the uh, to the to the day's uh, function. Let's talk about what contributions, what goals, and all of this team, and all just just from you all side. I heard coach. Yeah. Let's talk from the team. Uh, well, our goals are you know to just to come together as a team and take literally every game, day by, I mean game by game. We don't want to overlook anything. I mean we're in a uh, situation right now where we have no choice but to look at it you know game by game. All we're thinking about is September 1st and Prairie View right now, and every time we break a huddle, it's, you know, PV or PV this, PV that, that's the only thing on our mind right now, and that's building our unity every single day. What's been workouts like? The workouts? Yeah. Uh, workouts have been extremely intense. You know, I've never been... I've never been so exhausted after a workout, you know, until I came to Texas Southern. You know, I've been in some pretty, you know, extreme and intense workouts, but never as intense until I got here. Practice, are you on still in two days? Like it's, it's uh, yeah, we actually just finished up two days. Um, I'm not too sure how next week is looking. Like I said, you know, we try to take it day by day, you know, get as much rest as we can in between practices. But two days have been extremely intense. We try not to take it too hard on us. You know, uh, if we're going full pads one, one practice, you know, we'll lighten it up the next one. But we take every rep full speed, 100%, and, you know, we get better with that. We, you know, trying to just have iron, sharpen some iron. One of the, the duties of lineman is to do grunt work. Yeah. And be seen, yeah. but not be uh, pointed out, yes, as I said, by the referee. Yes, sir. Just, just, just the mentality of what the guys are yeah. right now, getting it, you know, just get, getting to that point. Yeah. Well, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I feel like I've taken it upon myself this season, you know, to kind of get everybody on the same page and, you know, give kind of everybody, you know, that killer killer instinct, you know, to go out and want to destroy and want to be the best every single play. And the way our offense is designed, you know, we're going to have a lot of uh, a lot of situations, a lot of plays where, you know, linemen are going to go out and get to go out, you know, and take some people's heads off, you know what I mean? So we're really excited just about the offensive scheme, the play calling, and, that, you know, we get to do some dirty work this year and, uh, you know, each, each and every person gets to have a little fun on that line this year. Well, I'm going to say this. A year ago, your eyes was all big. You was kind of like getting accustomed to what's going on. Now you got a smile on your face. So thank you must be selling in. Yeah, I really am. You know, I'm, I'm really, I've sold out to everything. I buy into, you know, every coach's program, every piece of uh, advice that they give me. You know, even if I feel that, you know, I am right, you know, at the end of the day, they are the coaches. And, you know, the only way we're going to unite and become a family is if we buy into the program and we're all on the same page. You know what I mean? Yeah, you're right. I do remember doing the interview with you right after the Prairie View game last year. You know, I was a little jittery. You know, it was my very first SWAC game. And right now, I've had that taste in my mouth since that last interview, sir. And I, I, that taste ain't going nowhere. Just, All right, then. Introduce yourself. I need your name, your number, your position, and your year. My name is Moses Alvidrez. I'm number 54. I play left guard, also center, and uh, from Long Beach, California. And this is Jerry Lee Willard Jr. with the College Sports Report. Thank you. Thank you.